Scary thought has Kevin Durant at last fully embraced Warriors ball? A weekly dive into the NBA's hottest topics. It's taken three years and happened in the midst of a flurry of reports pegging his fate as a New York Knick this summer, but Kevin Durant has never played more like a Golden State Warrior. For the past two years, the Warriors' offense has been defined by an existential tug of war between coach Steve Kerr's preference for dizzying sets, you a coaching adage passes move faster than players, you and a ant's preference for dizzying isolation moves. But these days, Durant is fully embracing Dove's ball. Since returning, to hear Durant, his mindset hasn't shifted. If I got one shot, there's some truth to that. Durant has relinked video by Fox Sports. Volume scoring, no matter how easy it comes, will always look like a Sisyphean task. By letting go of the, is it possible that the difference is merely cosmetic? Sure. Trey Young may never get his due in a Rookie of the Year race that always favors early bloomers, but that hasn't stopped NBA teams from guarding him like a star, boxing him into corners and picking him up from 30 feet, where he launches three-point cannonballs with no remorse. He has been flat-out scary since the All-Star break, not merely in the way every NBA star is if you're cheering against him, every successive dribble up half-court will turn another layer of your stomach inside out. He can kill teams, Young is letting it fly as if he takes being open as an affront upon his skill and the Hawks are reaping the benefits. They were 19th, man, is it ever infuriating that every win the Hawks notch decreases their chances of drafting Zion Williamson with the number one pick in the draft. The lottery system, every few years, some up and coming team inevitably finds its stride by some measure of development, chemistry and a refusal to shut down players for no reason, you characteristics of functionality that should be rewarded you and ends up paying the price later. When young players who could presumably benefit from low consequence minutes on the back end of a season are being sat down, the system isn't rewarding rebuilding. It's rewarding flat, so hey race a modest proposal skew the odds so that the closer a team is to the middle of the lottery pack, the better shot they have at the number one pick. Think of it like a pick. On April 9th, Miami Heat legend Dwayne Wade will play his final game at American Airlines Arena. Maybe it's the nost- Wade hasn't stubbornly kicked and screamed his way out of playability see Carmelo Anthony. And while this heats, Tom Crean, who coached him at Marquette, uh, toward others, and himself. It's allowed him to d I don't know whose side to take here LeBron James and Kevin Durant, for a on national television instead of say, literally anywhere else, or the legions of media outlets, who are breaking out the lip readers and speculating on what it all means. In the end, the sly grin on Durant's face takes the cake. The constant surveil- more from Yahoo Sports. Looking up, open the park pot, pot.